you know, there's some very significant things that, that happen throughout the service. You know, that I, one thing that uh, uh, struck me immediately, um, I actually, when you played Pachelbel's Canon, I was wait, waiting for a bride to kind of come up the aisle to, <laughs> sort of, well, they're already doing, uh, they're doing weddings over here in this chapel? Or, you know, the, but a lot of significant things, you know, when, uh, uh, it was very interesting when we, uh, we offered at, uh, at, at this uh, altar the sign of peace. And it, you know, it struck me that you know, in this, this place, you know, for the first time in the name of Christ, this place dedicated to Christ, people were offering a, a sign of peace to one another. You know, the only peace, that, the true peace that comes when we're in a relationship with, uh, with our Lord. You know. Thank Bill very much for taking on this project um, um, and for, for you, um, for having as a vision, uh, literally the importance of the relationship with Christ and our spiritual life in building uh, what we're called to do in the, in the name of the Lord. Um, thank you for what you do to our, for our community. You know, um, I'm sure there are many people whom you will never know personally, but obviously, you know, those of, who are your agents out there who have brought some type of peace and stability uh, and, and a sense of security uh, during uh, difficult times to, to so many people. Think about, uh, about that when you, when you come here and receive from the Lord, the Lord giving back to you kind of that, that sense of stability and that security, knowing that you, um, you are so much a, a part of Him. Um, May this uh, uh, chapel bring, bring forth great, great fruit for you. I thank Father John for being here. He's, uh, he supplies me with all my jokes. So, uh, you know, <laughs> what, 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 what book do I have now for me, Father John? The fifth? Four. I got four. Yeah, I'm waiting for the fifth. Well, I'm waiting for it, Father John. You know, I, I'm running out of material, so you've got to... Excuse me? This is Advent. I know this is Advent, I know. <laughs> you, you'd think I might know that, huh, Father, Father John? <laughs> <laughs> a, a, a great sense of his dedication and generosity to so many, so many priests and his dedication to the seminary in um, so many ways. So thanks, Father, Father John, for being here and uh, being so much a part of the, the great history of the Archdiocese of uh, Milwaukee. You know. uh, I, I thank uh, Bishop Jelano. I was telling Bishop Jelano his, uh, one of his, uh, I, I knew about him uh, back in 1979, 1980, because um, his vicar general went over to, uh, he sent his vicar general over Rome for studies, who was Bishop Sal Matano, you know, currently, and you know, later went on, was um, uh, secretary of the apostolic uh, uh, delegate. But Sal was um, uh, um, shared, we, we shared um, uh, literally um, uh, an office together. We were, there were three individuals who were the uh, head of the, uh, the household at the Casa. And it was Sal Matano, uh, now Cardinal Burke, would, uh, would have been Ray Burke at the time and myself. We were the three, three, three house, three kind of house leaders, if you want, you know, in terms of relationship. And of course, when we all get together, we, we all talk about our bishops. And Sal's bishop was John Jell. We also complain about our bishops too, but you know, that <laughs> <laughs> no, only good, only good things. All, all, only good, only good things. So I, I thank uh, Bishop Jell for being here and. Uh, I know it's a, it's a, a, a great spiritual um, voice for you last night, you know, as kind of shared uh, dinner with you. And uh, it's wonderful to see the, the wonderful connections that we have. I thank Father Jim Lobots, who is here kind of directing us. You know, you know, when you have something which is so ritualistic and out of, uh, literally out of the norm, you know, you always need somebody to take the hat off. You know, <laughs> take the hat off. You, know, so you need somebody to be doing that. Um, uh, uh, but you know, it, it, isn't, it, isn't this a great faith? Isn't it? It's just a, it is a wonderful faith. It is so integrates everything, our, every aspect of our life, every movement in our, our life, which is which is literally consecrated to God. And uh, we're so grateful that um, uh, that we as a, a community are part of it, and we can be fed um, by our God to enrich us uh, so much in, uh, in this life that, that He has blessed us with. So God bless all of you. Um, you know, may the Lord um, continue to guide you and, and direct you and always know that you are doing uh, His will. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. And I'll use the apostolic blessing. So the, uh, the Lord be with you. Before I um, um, bless, we didn't, uh, if we, Jim, if you could give me the, the water. Yeah. This is dedicated to all saints. And so we want to dedicate those saints whose images are used here, who reflects 
a, a, um, a literally a conglomeration of all the saints who are patrons um, of all the various um, uh, agencies and groups that you have all throughout uh, the country. And we bless these saints as representative of that. But as all statuary and aspects of, of saints, they reflect um, uh, an image to us of the sacredness, of virtue of life, uh, of, of holiness, and a, a direction and relationship to God. So we bless these statues. And may those who pray inter intercession uh, through and with them be drawn always closer to our Lord Jesus Christ. We pray this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord, now, now and, and forever. forever. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Amen. Who made Amen. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Mass is ended. Let us go now in love and peace to love and to serve the Lord. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God.